when they have grown old ba ka se le ba le tsela e ba rutilweng ka yona hallelujah amen that is the kind of wealth e tla me ara ba shiye le the question ke hore are we doing that have we been doing that amen amen hallelujah amen ke boletse ka re ke tlo matha i said i'm going to be very quick amen amen ke kopa ho le motswadi please when you are a parent ke kopa ho etsa show gore o dutse hantle mo stool make sure that you are seated uh, correctly on your seat amen amen because of the statistics tse re tlo ya motsona go na bjalo ka bakala di tlaiso tse that you are going to go through now do it with a shock a very hurtful hallelujah amen 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 re dutse hantle are we well seated re ready are we ready 78% of young people 78% ya batho ba batse they identify themselves ba ipona ele ba kreste christians they don't believe abadune gore ke ba kreste that they are christians but they identify empa ba ipona amen amen gona le papang e kgolo there's a big difference hallelujah amen 49% ya bona 49% of young people badumela gore religion itse tsotlhe di a tswana they believe that all whether muslim hindu ba bona di elentu e tswana they think it's the same thing hallelujah amen 45% of this young people jale 45% ya batho bana ba batho they can ba ba la bible la hangwe in a week they, they only read the bible once they can Hallelujah. Amen. This is the generation e long ho re phela ka yona. O na ke moloko that we live with. Hallelujah. Amen. Recently this morning, go se ngona. Gona le bana ba long ho re ba shwile ko thabeni this morning. There are children who died in a tavern go se ngona. Hallelujah. Amen. Almost 14 of them died this morning. Ba i 14 ka o fela ba. Ha ke ba le ba ileng gore ba hlokofetse ba last week this morning. The last two weeks who died. So within just two weeks. They can say be he fail. Re na le eh the next generation e la hlehileng. We have lost eh moloko o mokana moloko o tla. More than 30 of them within two weeks and uh, remember those are ke baileng gore go tlhailo mo ditabeng hopola they were published on the news so imagine baileng gore they've never said anything now nahana those whom go sabu one le tlo ka bona we need to help this generation hallelujah amen oi one out of five ya yeah, this generation one of them ka ra bana ba ifa they are attracted to the same gender ba ba ho helwa molo eh bong bo tsana le bong bana le khatlego they are attracted to the same gender motong ya tsana le yena he ra hore le bo o ratana le shimano o tsana le shimano o ratana le shimano aha ngwanyana o ratana le ngwanyana and a girl is in love with a girl This is the generation that we are dealing with. One out of four, they are always thinking about committing suicide in a less than three months. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. They spend more or less eight hours on social media. So na kwe wena we tsi yangwe ya merokong e le kana le the exact time e badula mo social media when they need information they rely ko google for information they take information from tiktok and build their life from there ba fumana dintho tiktok be ba ama phelo bona mo we are we going na re ya ka hallelujah amen and you need to know o hloka o tse e ke a itse re batswadi i know we are parents wa bona phone you see a phone ke best babysitter e o ka ifa ngwana 
78 verse 4. And we will not hide from them the descendants. We will tell them the next generation the praiseworthy, the praiseworthy deeds of the Lord. His power and the wonders that he has done. The minute we don't go back to this scripture, then we will be dealing with this generation. It is busy drifting away. Hallelujah. Amen. To tell them the truth. We need to teach them. We need to show them. Hallelujah. Amen. So the next generation would know them. Even the children yet to be born. Baba since in Basatla. But Lamea Hutsiba. They are old to know them. But we have moved away from telling the truth. Hallelujah. Amen. And then because of that, our nation. It is falling apart. Our nation. It is falling apart. We need to train and teach them in the right way. Hallelujah. Amen. That which we were told, we need to transfer it. But when we don't transfer it, where are we going? What kind of parents are we bringing up? Hallelujah. Amen. Something needs to stay within you. Amen. Amen. When you look upon this young generation, something needs to stay within you. Where did we lose this? Amen. Amen. Many of them are dying. Many of them are losing their lives. If you look within the church, they are busy moving away. We are losing them. Hallelujah. Amen. We have given the tablet. Rebafile the tablet. Lady phone. And phones. Kordiba Hudis. Saying they should bring them up. Banababangat. Many children. Bahudisa kidi tablet. Raised without parents. Because of we have moved away from them. May the Lord help us. That we go back to basic. That in the same way that we have been taught, we can be able. Go transfer a dead back to them. Hallelujah. Amen. May the Lord help us. We can't be having a situation where we lose the future leaders. Where we lose by the Amen. Amen. My message for today ends here. May the good Lord help us. If we are not going to do something, we are a lost generation. Shall we stand on our feet? You have heard the message. Let's pray. Let's pray. Father, 
If there's a child next to you, hold them, hold them by the hand and speak life over them. Speak life over them. Speak life over them. Any child nearby you, bring them closer. 